What's up guys, Nare here, gonna play a super game, Game Dev Tycoon. This is a super game, I have played it before, so I'm not, this is not a blind play. We're gonna make a super games, okay. I have to give my upcoming company a name. The name would be Taco Games. And my name would be Taco. I'm from uh, Mexico. I mean, I like Mexican food. I do not want to unlock hints. You think I'm such a noob? Whoa, it's sure is shiny around here. Alright, let's start a new game. Before development, why do I have tutorial? How do I disable tutorial? Hints off, tutorials, disable tutorials, yep, totally. Quality performance. Alright, the first game will be Werewolf. Killer. Killer tacos in shape of werewolves. A genre will be similar uh, action. Gonna run away from the werewolves, also known as the killer tacos. We're gonna use the G64 because that's the most popular thing right now. It's gonna, gonna, gonna have. It's gonna be text based. It's gonna be like, oh no, killer taco is approaching. What will you do? Run. Alright, uh, action means a lot of gameplay. Story sucks. Engine has to be good too. Damn, we're getting a lot of bugs in killer tacos. Dialogue sucks. I will design an artificial intelligence sort of. Pretty good. It's an action game. Who cares about dialogue and quests? Stop scratching your head and keep working. The sound has to be great. Graphics are average. World design. Not so much. It has to have, have like this satisfying sound effect. Pew 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 pew! Ugh, killer taco down! I repeat. Killer taco down! Now let's sort out the bugs. Alright, finish the game. Enjoy the killer tacos. New topic. New combo. Wow, look at all those experiences. 10 out of 10. Time to release the game. Create good a game with a good topic genre combination. I'm so happy. Now let's see what kind of... Let's research stuff. No, let's not research stuff. I have to see how it goes. Our first game, Killer Tacos, came in. A text-based adventure action game, I forgot. That's terrible. I shouldn't have done that. Who would want to play a text-based action game? The next game will be much better. We're gonna make a post-apocalyptic surviving burritos. It's about the burritos that survived. They're gonna adventure through the world. And it's gonna be on the G64. This time we'll have real graphics. We're gonna have to take a loan. 50k. I'll go bankrupt. Oh, crap. This will have to be the game that will save us all. It's an adventure game. That means we need some story and quest. Gameplay also pretty important. Engine not so much. An adventure requires a lot of story and quest. Dialogues, level design, artificial intelligence not so important. This game will have to work. Oh, I'm actually making money from the terrible game that I made. World design is important for the adventure game. Graphics too, sound not so much. We've gotta have like a super world to explore, adventure through, with a bunch of quests. It's sort of like Skyrim, the surviving burritos, looking for a shelter to survive from the zombies. The danger. This will have to be the game that will help us survive, win the world, game, world, or something. Another bloop? There's a bloop. Surviving Burritos is now coming out. Release the game. This has to be a successful game. Actually, let's just keep making games with what we have. 65, 66 grand, wow, I made a lot of more money than I thought with that game. Government. Simulated government. Leadership of 
nachos. I don't even know what I'm saying. Just, I think that's a good name for a government game. It's a simulation government game. You have to text and answer riddles. Surviving beater burritos came in. Come on, surviving burritos. What's going on? Why does it get so terrible raining? Could have been better. Their focus on world design served this game very well. Well, it's much better than the killer tacos, at least. But we will simulate the government. It requires... Gameplay... Not story and engine. Surviving Burritos was so successful that now we now have 18 fans. I'm glad you enjoyed that game. Dialogues in a text-based game is very important. And a simulation game requires... I don't know, good graphics and sound, and the world design may be not so important. Fix the bugs, and then let's throw this out on the market, we need more money. The most exciting game ever, simulating the government with text-based graphics, let's go. That's a car, oh nice. The Invento is planning to launch its very own home gaming console, holy crap dude. Let's check out the leadership of Tacos and Achos. Could have been better. What do you mean? Come on, give me like a, it's a it's a government simula uh, simulation game or something. I don't remember anymore. We're gonna have to generate game reports now. The killer Tacos. We'll start with that. I'm in the contracting business, and we could use skills like yours. Cool. Let's see what went wrong with Killer Tacos. Dialogue is not important for this type of game. So it was a pretty good game. Did I put dialogue in it? I hope I didn't. If I did, then I'm an idiot. 56 grand for the Surviving Burritos. It's time to check out the Surviving Burritos game report. Alright, Survival Burritos. Very important to have good world design for adventure, that's what I thought. I guess adventure and post-apocalyptic apocalyptic is not very, uh, not the best combination because there's not much adventure to be had. I think everything is destroyed, right? And uh, last, we have the leadership of Nachos. Why would people not want that game? It's the government game. 10k units sold. Holy crab! TES, I mean the Nintendo Entertainment System, but it copyright issues, you know. Leadership of Nachos, great combination. Level design seems to be important for a simulation game. Okay, so everything was pretty good for this game. Just people didn't like the government. I think we're gonna need a new game here. The game development. It's like the game I'm playing right now. Uh, let's call it Game Dev Tacos. Isn't that original? Thank you. Simulation game. It's going to be on a G64. It's the most popular thing right now. We're gonna simulate everything. Wow, that's a lot of money from leadership of Nachos. Simulation requires gameplay and engine. Who cares about story and quest? You gotta. The game has to run properly, and the gameplay has to be great. We're not here for any quest or stories. Now we're gonna have no dialogues, great level design, and artificial intelligence has to be somewhat good. Simulation, world design not so much, graphics, or I don't know, no, world design doesn't matter at all. Sound and graphics have to be very good. Fix the bugs right now. And then we release the game dev tacos to the public new record for the technology let's go now we have to research new topics let's see virtual pet that sounds awesome for those people that cannot have pets in real life they can have the virtual pet game dev tacos what do people think holy holy burritos why is everything getting so low rating I need tens 10 out of tens it's time to get Licensing rights on the Nintendo. Acquire license only 80,000. Wow, that's all my money pretty much.
Don't worry, I, I can afford it. It's gonna pay off totally. Virtual pet, or more like Gordi da pet, the virtual pet, simulating yourself having a pet. 2D graphics. This game will be the masterpiece. Gameplay has to be excellent for the babies. Story quest, no. Focus on the gameplay. Level design. Dialogues a little bit. AI. Something like this. Let's have good artificial intelligence. Our pet has to look very smart and realistic. Very important. Stop scratching your head. Keep going. World design, not so important. Maybe it's because I put nothing in some things that uh, they get no very bad rating. Alright, uh, virtual pad simulation, the sound has to be cute, the graphics has to be pretty good as well, we gotta see how cute the pad is, the sound has to make like super cute noises. And then we gotta fix the pads, I mean bugs, so the pads aren't broken, they have to be super realistic. And pads in real life shouldn't be have bugs in them. Oh, it's a lot of money from the game dev tacos. Maybe do one few more bubbles? No, remove the bug. No, get the bugs away. One more boop. Oh, there we go. Well, what happened? Oh, what's going on? Finish, please. Gordita Pat. Double new record. Release the game. I gotta find contract work here. Penalty. Something very easy. I have to help play test the game. That sounds great. Let's do that. Mm, that's a pretty good game you have there. Can I handle it in time? Gordida Pat. Virtual Pat and Simulation. Come on, why is it... Why doesn't it get better ratings? All games. Pretty nice. Why is the rating so bad? Everybody has to get Gordida Pat. For the Nintendo. I completed my contract. Good job. Well, let's check out the da game report for Game Dev Tacos. And the other game, once I complete this one. Game dev and simulation, great combination. Level design seems to be quite important for simulation game. That's good to know. What about the Gardita pad? Great combination and engine seems to be important. Yeah, that's what I did, right? The pad had to be working function properly. Maybe I didn't. Well, that would be a shame. Game history, very nice. We have to research a custom game engine now. We gotta get our own game engine soon. We can't be bothered to get licenses for other stuff. Ninvento! I love the games that come with the TES. This feels much better to play with a controller. I researched custom game engine, now I can research more stuff, which I'll do later. First we gotta get a successful game running. I'll research a new topic. Let's see. New topic. Aliens. We're gonna make an action alien game on the Nintendo. Pew pew pew! Like Space Invaders. Choo, 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 choo. Now let's get it started. This will be the game. Aliens. Action. Nintendo. TES. 2D graphics. 2D shooter like Mega Man. Pew pew! Uh, extremely nice gameplay, awesome engine, tiny bit of stories. So you have like an objective, you're not lost in the game. Great level design, very little dialogues, great AI. Super sound, okay world design. 50-50 world design and graphics, but the sound has to be very satisfying because it's an action game. Gonna be like pew, 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 pew. I can now research target audience. That'll be good for my future games. Custom custom game engines. A alien action game needs a few more bubbles to make me happy. Okay, that should be good enough. It should be like the best game. This should be it. New topic, new combo, bunch of extra experience. Generate game report for something br 
Did I forget to give it a name? Reviews for nothing. Holy crap, look at the rating I'm getting for nothing at all. 9, 8, 8, and a 9, 8. My nothing game is excellent. I'm selling lots of nothing. Damn, ka-ching! My post-analysis of nothing is complete. Aliens and action is a great combination. I knew, I know, right? It's like Mega Man. Now we're gonna develop a new game. It's gonna be post-apocalyptic and action. It's gonna be like, I'm gonna be the action master. I probably was gonna type a name and forgot to do it. Kill the Sambays. That's gonna be the name of the game. Another action game. Engine. Gameplay. Story. Engine is important for action games, they said. So let's do that. A little more than gameplay then. AI. Level design. The levels have to be fun. Then, uh, oh, no. Sound has to be good. And graphics. Oh, this is just the same, pretty much. Alright. Fix the bugs. Add a few more bubbles. If possible. And then we finish. Nothing is off the market. Oh, nothing made me a lot of money. Oh, two more yellow bubbles. Excellent. Kill the Sambay. So let's release that game. Do you like killing the Sambays? Seven is okay. Beautiful. Wow, thank you, informed gamer. Good game. Thanks, dude. Shows potential. Screw you. Super game. Let's check out the game report for Kill the Sunbase. I'm getting a lot of fans here. 785 fans. Great combination. Action TES. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's start researching stuff for our custom game engine. Let's research target audience. That's gonna be good for everything, uh, I think, right? Master V, wow. I successfully researched target audience. Wait, I can use that for, yeah, every, for everything. I should do that er earlier. Gameplay sound general. Let's research. Mono sound. Kill the zombies, it's off the market? No, the zombies are gonna escape now. They're gonna get away. Kill us all, eat, eat our brains. Oh, I can't research anything else. Let's create a new game. Let's uh, r actually research something great for Nintendo. The Wild West. Probably not. We have to find something for young babies. I don't know. I need a researching search on good. Sports game, of course. Babies love sports. It's gonna be like a 2D soccer game. Wow. How does that even work? It's gonna be like slime volleyball. Well, actually it's kinda will be kinda cool to play on. A Nintendo, to be honest. So it's gonna be called Slime Tacos. For young people, because this is a Nintendo entertainment system. We'll have it's gonna be an uh, action game. Right? Sports. Action. That's, uh, that's what it should be. 2D graphics. Let's go. Engine has to be great. Gameplay as well. Story quest. Like, almost none. What kind of story are there going to be in my slime tacos? Well, this is just an action game, so I'll just leave it as it is. I can research casual games for those casual players. The sound, graphic, world design, no, it's a sports game. But it needs a world to be in. Like, it's located in the heart of America. Do, 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 do. Maybe add a few more bubbles for the yellow ones and the blue, the light blue ones. More light blue, maybe one, one, one more, one more, one more. No, not a bug. Get that bubble out of the way, please. Okay, screw it. Let's go. Slime tacos are ready! Yummy. Better user experience. Level editor. We gotta research all this stuff, man. Casual games. 
That's a new genre, right? The gameling. It's the Game Boy. How do you like my slimy tacos? Holy crap, nine. Oh, seven. Seven. Eight. One of them gave me nine. That's like almost the best rating. Ka-ching! My slimy tacos are winning the world. I researched casual games. Now it's time to get a better user experience. I'm gonna research what, what I have and then I'll develop a custom game engine. I don't think I can research the last thing though. I need more research points. Oh, I have enough research points. Only 10 needed. Riot points. Let's develop a new or create a custom engine. 2D graphics, linear story, Save the game, better everything, we're gonna get everything we have. And there will be taco number, this is our first taco, taco pad one. We are researching, creating the taco pad. Every time I make a new game engine, I'll just add a different number. Taco pad two, isn't that original? Taco pad three, taco pad four, taco pad five. With a growing interest in video games, there is also a growing audience for video game magazines. Nice. Marketing can now be researched. Tacklepad 1 has been complete. Now let's make a new game on the Tacklepad. Alright. It's an engine, and then I have to select a platform. It's not the. I thought uh, it would be like its own console. The Derp. This game will go on the PC. Whoa, the gameling is serious popular right now. How much it cost? 50 grand? We're gonna go on the PC. No, we're not. We have to research another topic here. New topic, school simulation. Isn't that exciting? If I get one million in cash, you'll be able to move to the next level. Damn, that's a lot of money. How will I do that? I only got 290,000. We're gonna have to make the best school game for children. Wouldn't it be fun to play a school game? That is actually an action game. The children will be all like, no, mom, I don't want to play a school game. And then it's gonna be full of egg tacos. It's gonna be full of tacos. Taco pad, T E S. Let's go. Super graphics. The action school, high school of the dead. Gameplay. Who cares about story and quest? We just want a great engine and gameplay. <laughs> Whoops! I forgot to select all the things to the right. That sucks so bad. Can I select it later? Because I forgot. Oh my god! Level editor. I can't believe I did that. Do I trash the game? Mono sound. Well, whatever. I missed the beginning. I don't think it matters that much. But I, 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 I messed up. That's for sure. The fool of tackles is on the market. Give me those ratings. Whoa! Ding dong, ling ling ling. We're gonna need a, also another school game. It's gonna be for everyone, and it's gonna be the casual game. Hablo Inglés. It's gonna be for the PC. Gotta learn English or Spanish, whichever you want to. Full of tacos! How can you go wrong when it's full of tacos? Very good. Nice experience. Played it for days. Love it. Oh my god. They're so generous. What did I miss here, by the way? Casual game. Requires, like, a lot of story and quest. Who cares about the engine? Who cares about the gameplay? I just want story and quest. No, they don't want story and quest. They want gameplay. They just want the gameplay to be good. They just want to play and be casuals. So here you go, casuals. 
lots of gameplay for you. The level design. They want good level design. They don't want live dialogues or artificial intelligence. They just want the great levels, gameplay. And they want the game to be beautiful. So the game will be beautiful. 2D graphics version 2. Maybe good world design too. The Commodore 64 will take be taken off the market. No, that means the PC will rule everyone, rule all the world. Hablo Inglés going on the market. New combo. How do you like my Hablo Inglés? Nah, it's not so good. Could have been better. No Hablo Inglés. Okay, we have Ramus commenting. Their focus on graphics served this game very well. I guess it didn't go that well. The Govador 64 are bankrupt. Ah. Damn, we need like a super game, but it's not working out too well. Let's generate game reports for our slimy tacos and other such things. Slime tacos, great combo, sports and action. Very important to have good AI. Young TES, great. So that was a great game. I'm going to research marketing so we can try and market our games or something. I don't know exactly what it does. Let's develop a new game. This will be government for the old people. It's gonna be a casual game on the PC with my taco engine. I'm gonna try government again. I just find it uh, funny genre or whatever it was called topic I mean leading the horses don't you love the government game yeah you can save your game isn't that great so you can keep on playing the government leading the horses we need some dialogue so people can talk together some AI and the graphics have to be superb. Who cares about sound? Just the graphics, man. We heard a rumor that the company is developing a game for ma major audience, mature audiences. Yeah, great. Thank you for your time. They're gonna publish my interview. Cool. Yeah, it's gonna be a super game. Oh my god! Look at that hype. Fifteen hype. To lead the horses. Give me a little more bubbles for it so they can. I'll finish it once the hype starts dropping. Once it goes 14, I'll f click finish. Oh, finish. Oh, baby. Let's go. Better dialogues in open world. We have to generate more game reports. Actually, no, I don't want to. Leading the horses is out. They have achieved a great balance between technology and design. Quirky, but good. Shows potential. Their focus on gameplay served this game very well. Wow. That's cool, I guess. I guess we'll find contract work. That's not too difficult for one person. I gotta design some game characters. I'll design Sonic and Mario and Luigi. Err... No, I'm running out of time. Stop scratching your head. I failed. Well, great. I lost money. That was a terrible... Why did I... Why was I so bad at doing it? I gotta develop one more game. And th hopefully this game will be the thing that we want. Our dream. I guess I'll make a gambling game. For babies. It'll be like... For school. Virtual pet again. Simulator. It's gonna be like the game where you control an egg or something, whatever that was called. Taco egg. For young people, you can control your egg. Great graphics, 10 out of 10. Engine and gameplay. It's no story. 
Gotta take care of your pet. Very important. No dialogues. Artificial intelligence level design. How do I market this? Th marketing. I gotta market the taco egg. Whoa. Two million. We're only gonna spend like 150k. And the sound and graphics. I think the graphics is most important. The pet gotta look good, you know. Oh, wait, maybe the sound is quite, quite important too. We also need more, uh, we're gonna advertise in magazines. Look at all the hype going up. This is crazy. Now let's wait until the hype starts dropping and then we release it. People are like super hyped and then we're mas making this a masterpiece. Well, people are hyped. And then when they stop hyping, all of a sudden it's released. Stop! I don't care. I want to check out my hype dropping. Okay, there we go. The best game. This is the game. The taco egg. Let's see what people think. This must be it. The masterpiece. Taco egg. Do your job. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Eight dollars! Seven. Seven. Nine! Oh my god, the hype really paid off. This should be like one million dollars and we can move out. Ka ching Whoa! Wow, look at all the people that started buying it after the first week. 50k units sold. Whoa, 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 whoa. 60k units. I'll do something meanwhile, like uh, generate game report. Like find out what went wrong, if there went something wrong. Something I could have done better with a taco egg. Maybe I'll reach 100k units sold. It's not far away. 12 more k. Oh, level design seems to be quite important, it said, I think. 8 more k and I should have enough to get 100k units. Almost there, 98. Start, keep doing the game reports. Leading the horses. 100k. Important milestone in the taco games. Yes. It's starting to sell more again. How is that even possible? I've made a quite a name for myself. If you want to grow the company further, then moving into an office is the next step. I found the perfect office situated in technology part. Would you like to move your company to the next level? Totally. We just have to immediately make a game so we don't run out of money just as we start. Hire staff and forge a world-class development team to make even better games. Well, I'm taking a break now, guys. We'll continue this next time. Have a good day. Bye-bye. First, we'll see... Government and casual is a bad combination. Platform genre match, terrible. <laughs> okay, that was terrible. I guess. But it didn't get that bad of a rating. So yeah, bye guys.